Hello and welcome to a new video on this channel. Now I will show you how to crawl a single article using Crawlomatic and import it to your post. So I already have tutorials on how to crawl multiple articles sourced from a single seed page. So if you enter a single seed page, the plugin can crawl all the articles that are linked from that page. But now let's sh let me show you how to import a single article. So if you want to import just a single post like this, I have selected this uh, TechCrunch post. So let's uh, copy its URL and paste it here. So this is the first step. You should paste the URL in the start seed URL uh, for when you create your rule. Set the max post to 1 to only import this single article and not continue crawling the post for other links and click settings for advanced settings. Now we should go to our article and check from where should the plugin import the content. So the main content of this article is this article class article container. We clicked inspect on the content and we hover here our mouse over the HTML and we should select the HTML that includes the entire post content. So if you check this, you will see that this includes the entire article content. So this class is the one that we need. This includes the entire article content, only the textual content. So yeah, you can see now that class is article content. Double click the article content, copy it and go to plugin settings and scroll down until you see content query type. Here you must select class because you had a class here and input the copied class name here in the query string, content query string. Basically, this is the all, this is all you have to do. Now save settings and let's delete all posts that were on the blog. And now let's run importing. We should go to our blog and let's check the imported article. As you can see, the post imported the content. Let's uh, go and check some advanced use cases. So let's say I want to remove this block from the post, the, from the crawl post. Now I right click, click inspect and check the class the same way we checked before. So this content is included in this uh, div class embed. Now copy this embed class name, click settings and search for strip HTML elements by class and paste the embed uh, the name, the class name that you copied, save settings, delete the old post and re-import it. Let's refresh the imported post now. And as you can see, the, uh, the div disappeared, which we wanted to remove. It disappeared. Okay. Now let's say we also want to import a featured image from this post. In this case, we right click on the featured image, click inspect and copy its class, article content wrap. So, and also you can also do this or copy the class of the featured image article uh, this is it and go to plugin settings uh, 
Also, if you want to include the featured image in the article, this is something else I want to show you, then you should modify and instead of, as, so if you check this, sorry, this, so this class includes only the textual part. If you uh, check up the text, only the textual part is highlighted if you hover over this. But if you hover over this one, this div, then also the featured image is highlighted. So let's change now the class from article content to article container. And now click save. Let, let's reimport our post. And now we will see also the featured image in our content if we refresh the page normally. So you see the featured image and still the quote is removed because we still have that in settings. Okay, so I hope I was clear in the explanation of this importing process. I hope you enjoyed these videos on this channel. If you like them, please subscribe for more. And until next time, don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye.